Hello guys, once again today we are here and I hope you people are fine. So this is the another video of an eBay dropshipping course. As you know better that we have started an eBay advanced course from basic to advanced. And we have almost completed our first part that was product research and if you remember so we have discussed the product research manually and also using software Zik Analytica so today uh, let me share my screen with you and discuss the another topic of an eBay dropshipping course all right so this is the second part of an eBay dropshipping course that is called product listing. We have completed the product research manually and also using the software. So we will start our second part that is product listing. So what will we discuss inside product listing? Remember that we can list product using two method the first method is product listing manually and we can also use a software called AutoDS for product listing so definitely we will start from product listing manually so let's do it practically all right so remember that we will mainly focus on four things in product listing manually the first thing that should be the title you know that it play important role in product listing title why because if you have an seo title so definitely your product will be rank and once your product rank on ebay first page so there are more chances that people will click your product and definitely if people click your product so then definitely there are more chances that those people will buy your product but there are also some other uh, uh, other things too that also depend on your product listing the other thing is picture remember that this point play a vital role in your product listing just imagine you know if you create an seo title and your uh, your product also uh, you know rank on a first page but your picture is not an eye catchy picture so definitely the people will not click on your listing and if there is no click there will be no sell and if there is no sell there will be no profit that's why uh, an eye catchy picture play important role in product listing and definitely description so we will discuss that how we can use an html template in ebay product listing description and also we will try to discuss the bullet points inside description because uh, you know it it also play important role if your description is a, like a story type if there are bullet points if they, if there is also picture present in your description too so the people will like your work and also you know the item specific uh, you know that inside item specific how we can add the feature of the product uh, and each and everything we will discuss inside item specific uh, remember that these four things uh, in play important role in your product listing okay they are the major things so uh, definitely we will start from our first point that is title so ebay listing title remember that we can create an seo title using two method the first method is you know from from our competitor we can make an seo title a good title that that brings sell and we can also use the zik analytic for title 
for title creating okay inside zig analytic there is an option called title builder and with the help of that option we can create an seo title so All right uh, so you know i will come to chrome and you can see that uh, this product is sold 618 times uh, this product is demandable product and also profitable uh, you know let me show you the source this amazon is the source inside amazon uh, the price is 28 dollar 99 cents and inside ebay the price is 36 dollar so uh, there is almost you know two dollar and half and almost two and half dollar profit which is huge and you can see uh, the history of this product 13 june 15 june 8 june and today is 17 june so you can see that in uh, you know in june uh, it sold almost one two three four five six seven eight eight times uh, so this product is demandable product uh, but the question is that uh, how we can create uh, an seo title for this product because uh, uh, let's say i want to list this product uh, so how i can be changed from this seller you know uh, if i look uh, if i copy this title and let me also show you uh, the competitor who who use the same title uh, okay uh, let me show you you can see that this seller also this is the same product and this seller use the same title there is no difference you can see the whole the same title and this is the first one seller and you can see this seller also use the same title and even this seller also use the same title this seller this seller uh, you can see if you scroll down so uh, much more seller used uh, the same title but we will not do like this type we have to be changed we have to be a little bit changed from this seller so then ebay will rank us uh, so the question is how we can change us from this seller in title all right uh, and uh, you can see uh, here the price is 28 and here the price is 36 so it means that the product is demandable so let's say I want to list this product so the method that I personally use for my uh, product listing or for my creating the title for product let me show you and let me share that method with you so I will open uh, a Google translation and uh, here you can also do this work inside a uh, world file too okay and uh, the question is why you do it inside uh, Google translation so here actually uh, I can see the character if I write something so here I can count the character so inside uh, remember that uh, inside uh, ebay title you can almost uh, write up to 80 character not more than 80 okay so what i am gonna do is simply copy the title of this seller why i will tell you the reason and come to google translation and paste it inside google translation now the question is why you copy this title look at me here carefully you know this seller this seller use this title so he almost he or she almost got 618 order on this title first one part the second part this seller use this this title and he is ranked on a second number in ebay page you can see this is the seller and you know let me also uh, remove some word from here so then we will check it again so this seller is here again and if i remove uh, this words to these words too and just uh, you know write the two pack sit long range will kai tell kai so you can see this seller is again here so it means that the title that he used in his in his listing this is profitable 
title here are some words uh, due to that words uh, the listing can be rank so uh, you can see that those word are this one you can see long range long range well kai tell kai this is the main keyword so we will not disturb these words these five uh, or five to six words why because you know if you disturb these word if you if you remove one or two words from these words so then it will be disturbed so what i'm gonna do is here in this title i already know that this title is a, a you know rankable title but here i will just uh, you know uh, here i will bring little bit change inside this uh, this title so what i'm gonna do is simply here remove the extra word those words which is not you know rankable like this type of words and remember that uh, you know you can uh, you can remove the uh, you know like uh, for uh, the or you can also remove the ah uh, and like this type of words you can remove so uh, you know uh, this is the source and here this uh, we want to uh, we want to create uh, title from this source so here if you look so two packs sit long range well kai tell kai 50 mile two ways radio charger waterproof best so now this word is extra best best you know it is not like a, uh, you know uh, a word that defined this product uh, it is not like this type of word but if you look to this word like long range well kai tell kai so this word defined this product uh, okay and two ways radio definitely this word also defined this uh, this product so we will also not disturb this uh, this word and charge you can see this word so here if i look uh, so here are some words that i can remove those words uh, waterproof and best why because these are extra you know uh, what i am gonna do is simply go to the source mean here and here i will try to find the rankable words if i find so okay then i will come and paste it here instead of these words if i can't find so these words are also okay here i will just then uh, remove the best with new so then i will be little bit change from the from that one seller but here let me first see if i can find something best uh, instead of these two word so what i'm gonna do is uh, i will read this title uh, uh you know remember that uh, never use the brand name inside your title okay uh, remember this words too i i cannot recommend you that you use the brand name like this is the brand name uh piston or what is it i don't know okay so well kai tell kai rechargeable long range two ways radio you can see the same title well kai tell kai you can see here well kai and long range so as i mentioned that uh, uh remember that never disturb the first five to six word okay so uh, here long rechargeable two ways radio with air pieces uh, now you can use this word ear pieces uh, okay because here if you look so here we have these ear pieces you can see here these one one is this one and one is this one so here the this word is also present instead of these two words you can use uh, air pieces but before that let me read the whole title two ways radios uh, uhf hand held yes you can also use this word to handheld after charge radio handheld okay because it is like a handheld you can see and trans transceiver will kai tell kai wow this is another this is another keyword 
this is another keyword so i think this is the best one transceiver will kai tell kai if i come to amazon and i want to check whether the whether this keyword define this product or not so i will hit the search button and scroll down so definitely you can see uh, when i pasted this keyword so the same product you know like the relevant product uh, i can see this one this one yeah, these are the relevant products so it means that this keyword also define this product uh, and let me also uh, if i can find my own product so you know the relevant one you can see uh, yeah this one is like the relevant uh, and uh, if i come to the second page uh, so you know the relevant one uh, so i like this keyword because uh, uh, you know uh, you know this uh, this keyword this keyword uh, define our product this one so instead of waterproof new i will use this keyword because it is it is good it is a keyword and this is not a keyword it is just a words so i will use this one a uh, two pack set long range well kaitel kai 50 mile two ways radio this is also a good keyword two ways radio okay uh, charge transceiver well kaitel kai but here if i look so the words are more but i like this keyword so i will not disturb this keyword too and here i will remove some extra words so as i mentioned that don't disturb the first five to six words okay and here i will check from here if i can remove something extra so 50 mile 50 mile two ways radio so this one is also a relevant one and 50 mile so if you look so actually uh, this one is a uh, 50 mile or what let me check all right so let me scroll down and all right so and if i check another thing so that is a charger so i think uh, i think the 50 mile uh, uh, i think the charge is an extra words here if you look to the title if you look to the title here so here is a no char char yeah here is a charger word but that is at the end okay so a charge charge is an extra here because uh, the 50 mile is also you know like uh, attractive thing uh, in, in in our title so uh, you can see here is again 81 character so i will remove one word again and uh, here if i remove uh, two pack uh, two pack sit long range well kai tell kai 50 mile two ways radio transceivers will kai tell kai so here i will remove this space okay so now here it become the 80 character and i am also new from that one seller you know uh, the the title is the same one i know that this title bring uh, up to here the title is the same one and why i use this because i know that if that seller got 618 order so i can also i can also get some order on this title too if he rank on a first page so i can also rank but i have to little bit change from this seller so uh, i hope you people got point uh, and uh, you know that uh, this was uh, actually the first method that how we can use uh, uh, how we can create an seo title 
using our competitor and you know we have another way also that is zig analytic inside zig analytic there is a title builder we can also create an seo title inside zig analytic but i personally use this method and uh, right now uh, definitely uh, you will have a uh, questions in your mind so if you have any question in your mind uh, i always like to assist you and you know whenever you face any problem uh, any confusion so this is our group you can also join this group and uh, post your query here and we will try to respond to you as soon as possible so thank you once again and uh, if you like this video so wait for the next video too thank you